Which of these is an example of risk that should be identified in an implementation plan for a server virtualization deployment? Option A. Duration of scheduled outages required. Option B. Software licensing projections. Option C. Malformed ICMP packets on Ethernet. Option D. Generation of private slash public security key pairs. The correct answer is option A. A virtualization technical specialist is under a deadline to get a configuration of an N-series unified storage solution created and sent back to a customer for approval. They normally do the configuration, but have previous commitments. What process would get the configuration done? Option A. Engage IBM Global Finance IGF, to provide the configuration with the financing options. Option B. Submit a request to TechLean or the distributor. Option C. Engage IBM Global Services IGS, to create the configuration. Option D. Ask the customer to use the online N-Series eConfig. The correct answer is option B. The TS product family delivers data to duplication to virtual tape libraries. Which of the following individuals should the virtualization specialist consult to set performance and data reduction expectations? Option A. Techline specialist. Option B. Protect ear specialist. Option C. Customer's IT specialist. Option D. Tivoli Storage Manager TSM, Specialist The correct answer is option B. A client is planning to install Integrated Virtualization Manager IVM, on PowerBlade servers. Which of the following tools would an administrator use? Option A. HMC version 6.1 or greater. Option B. Blade Center's AMM Interface Console. Option C. Tivoli Management Environment, TME. Option D. Firefox Web Browser. The correct answer is option B. Thank <laughs> you.